Okay, Coach, uh, is there much you can find fault with tonight, 72-12? Uh, to 12? Uh, You know, the, the two touchdowns, they got a long run and a long pass on us in the first half. You know, that was kind of disappointing because, you know, we're, we're playing so well at that time. We gave up those two long passes. But, you know, I, I, I like the way our kids came out. We made a few little mistakes. But, hey, our kids got after and did a great job. So I'm proud of them. Were you expecting a score like this tonight? No, I, I thought we could score, but I knew that they could score too. But, you know, when they lose their quarterback and running back, that really hurts. Them and you know, I heard it's not good for them, and I hate hearing that for any kid. You're, uh, you know, Midwest City has a backfield of Timothy Flanders and Antonio Brown, but your backfield uh, uh, is about just as good, isn't it? Or? I think they're just as good, and, and sometimes they're even better. I think because they're a little, they're uh, they're strong. I mean, they're hard, tough runners, and they have got that breakaway speed. So that's that's a good combination for yeah. us. So. Stephen Sumter, five touchdowns tonight. Is that how many he had? Yeah. Wow, he's he played an awesome game, an awesome uh, game. And Randy Ponder had another. 100 yard games and barely playing uh, two and a half quarters. Yeah, I know. And like I said, that's one thing we taped down our line. Hey, give those guys an opportunity because we got two of the best backs in the state. Yeah, and your reserves, uh, even when they got in the game, they played well. Oh, yeah. I mean, that, you know, and, and that's what I hated to do at the end of it, but I didn't want to score again against them. I mean, but you got young kids out there. Heck, they want to play, but we've got enough playing in there where at the end I said, guys, we don't want to embarrass them. I mean, we beat them. Let's don't embarrass them anymore.